I'd already gotten my degree from another university and whenever I was given the opportunity to be able to enroll in art classes part-time, I fell in love with it and it was something I wanted to continue. I ended up enrolling in a few ceramics classes and I took intro to sculpture and everything changed. This summer I'm doing an internship with sculptor and painter, Arkansas native, Kevin Cressy. I make my living as a painter and a sculptor in Little Rock, Arkansas. I never had an art class until I attended UA Little Rock. I'm realizing, spending this time with him, how important it is to see someone working in their craft on a daily basis. Through this internship, I, I, I hope Courtney sees me honestly speaking to her about what my path has been about trying to make a living as an artist and that she feels comfortable in the future if she gets to a point where maybe it's a big commission and she has a question that she feels free to call me up and bounce something off of me. And these are the relationships that are formed that go on through life. As a working artist, those connections are priceless. And I wouldn't trade them for anything at this moment. And I don't know where else I would have been able to get that other than UA Little Rock. There's a symbiotic relationship there between UA Little Rock and myself, I think that's gone on for decades. And so it makes me feel good to be able to do something to help the students at UA Little Rock as far as being able to come in and give a talk or to do an internship. And it just keeps the whole idea of what a university is for. Being in the art program and just having the ability to fail and learn from my mistakes is huge. They give me a safe space to fail. My instructors are always pushing me, try this, do this. Why aren't you exploring this other avenue? It's okay to fail. You might love it. And if you love it, you might hone in on it and you might be really good at it. How else do you find out?